When Rachel and I bought our van during the height of the COVID pandemic, we immediately went to work converting it into a home. We spent a ton of hours and quite a bit of money in this process. After making the interior livable, we loaded up and headed out on our first adventure. This ugly black van has taken us hundreds of places and thousands of miles. However, we never spent any time on the exterior look of the van, focusing instead on making the interior a comfortable place to live. Well, we decided it was time to make our van look a little more appealing as it takes us down the road. So we're saying goodbye to the Black Pearl. What's up, everybody? If you're new to the channel, I'm Tommy. I'm Rachel. Badger. <laughs> and that's what used to be the Black Pearl. Now it's a different color van. Yeah. In fact, we have no clue what to call it yet. <laughs> I thought about Pecan Sandy, because you know, <laughs> Oreo Speedwagon, Pecan Sandy, I don't know. Yeah. I thought about Sable, because it's a French word for sand. Sounds kind of sassy to me though. Thought about, I don't know. So, if you think of a name for it now, just bleep bloop it down in the comments and we'll, yes, bleep bloop it so hard. Help us come up with a name. You can't go that way. So, told you we had big stuff coming and there it is. This has actually been rhino lined. Well, just bed liner, and you can see it has this. Because you know we're always going, we're, we're always going out in the woods and always going through brush and stuff. And this way, it'll protect it. Come here. Did it the old-fashioned way. Rattle can. I know people are going to freak out that we did it that way. But luckily, we didn't ask anybody's opinion before we did it this way. Is there, are there better ways to do it? Absolutely. They had the roll-on stuff and all that, but the time we had and the resources we had, this is what we could do. And this is still, you know, still $100 worth of paint right here. We still have some trim things to do on it. Uh, door handles, the mirrors and all that. We're going to rhino line black. Well, not rhino line, it's actually rust-oleum bed liner we have wheels on back order gonna put some all terrains on it but it looks it looks like a different van so we're gonna go look for a place to sleep tonight we just kind of wanted to stop here at the same place we stopped to take pictures of it the other day uh, this is actually Juniper Point on it's north of Whitesboro Texas on the Texas side of Lake Texoma. Um, but yeah, y'all, if you think of a name, not stupid. It has, and whoever comes up with the name that, that we pick, we'll, I'll get, we'll give them a shout out on the channel. Anyway, it's, it's hot out here uh, again. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, fall's coming. Thank y'all for watching. We're going to shut this video down and bye. <laughs>